Hi there guys, Jindal Pet here, and today I'm going to show you how to play Minecraft Pocket Edition on your desktop with Android. So, you still have to buy the game, or you can download, you know, the uh, if you want to download the APK or whatever, that should be fine too. But as you see right here, I have Minecraft Pocket Edition, and you see the little mouse, that's because I'm playing on my PC. So, uh, what uh, this is, uh, basically it's a simulator it's an app that simulates uh, Android, an Android device. So you have all the power of a PC and uh, you can run the Android games. So like you go in here and you go to Play Store and you can uh, come out here and update what you want. It's kind of limited in that like uh, I tried a, a FPS game and that didn't work very well. But uh, Minecraft is the one that seems to work really well for me. Um, there's a little... Uh, little sound issue but if you're like me and you want to play android you want to play the beta and stuff like that this is a great way to do it without having an actual android device and uh you don't pay for the app, the uh the nox app player itself you pay for the uh you know if, there, if there's a game like uh like uh say if this game is like you know 10.99 uh you would pay for that but you don't pay for the actual app that runs the uh, android store and all of the uh Android software and all that stuff. So uh, let's go ahead and jump in real quick, guys. So it, it's just like an Android, like I said. Uh, you can come down here and it kind of minimizes stuff, and you can flip it up if you want to, and then you go back to the home screen. But I want to do Minecraft, so I'm gonna double click that, and as you see right there, we're on a 0 0.12.1 Alpha Build 9, which is uh, up to date right now, as far as I know. Uh, it's August 18, 2015. And I'm using my, my mouse cursor, as you see right there again. And let's go ahead and you can go over here. You can change your name if you want to. You can just call yourself uh, Skimmy McFly. I don't know who that was. Skimmy McFly. Okay. So I'm Skimmy McFly now. And uh, I can change the difficulty all the way up to four. And just change the takes if I want to. I've got it on this one down here. And we got the the third person and then the kind of first person view and then third and a half, uh, third and a half person, whatever it is. Uh, render distance, we have all the way up to five. We have the FOV slider here. And then we have, you know, everything. So uh, I don't know what's up with Alex right now. And then uh, there's Alex. Okay, so I'm just going to go down to a town folk here. I'm going to be a butcher. Or I'm going to be a blacksmith. And then back out. And that's who I'm going to be this time. So I wanted to show you, uh, you can make your own, new, own world if you want to. I already did one. Uh, just going to call it home world and enter. And I'm just clicking to, you know, do that. Uh, creative survival, you can do that. Or you can do advanced. You can do the external servers if you want to. Um, Nyan real quick, just to see. And then we got world type infinite or survival and creative. I'm going to do creative. And look how fast that populated. All right, so let me show you real quick. If you, oh, that was really fast. All right, so I've got this uh, already laid out and everything. Um, you can actually change it to full screen, which is over here on the right. Uh, there's a button right there. There we go. So we got full screen now. We got the bars over here, but that's because uh, I think it's not. I don't know. Whatever. But to, uh, to move around, I've already uh, keyed these in. So I've got W, A, uh, sorry, W, A, S, D. And then I got the, I'm already flying. And I got flying as a, or jumping as space bar. So if I press double space bar, I start to fly or fall. And then crouch is Z. Of course, you have to double tap it, so... You know, you're sneaking around. And you see I'm not falling into the water there. And that's because I'm sneaking. And double Z again. So you can uh, you can make the different things uh, how you want. The only thing is uh, you can't control is this cursor right here. So you have to actually use a, uh, a uh, left click on the mouse or a right click on the mouse to hold it. And as you see, you can you can run. Uh, unfortunately, you can't run and like uh, go higher at the same time. 
So it's like either or. But um, like I said, you can uh, you can set the the controls how you want. You go up here to keyboard, and then see I have W A S D Z. I said that wrong. Uh, and I also have these uh, hot key down here, the hot bar, to different numbers, just like they are in a PC version. And you can go to clear. You can do save, or you can do uh, do element for directional control. I wonder if that will work with. I don't know. All right, let's get back in there real quick. I didn't like that. All right, and I got a space bar over here for jump, and then, like I said, you can change it out as you want to. I just, uh, I have it that way, and you can click save here, but I'm all good, so, whoops. Now, like I said, there, there's, a, there's a little bit of a room for improvement. Like, I stopped, like, a little while ago. I stopped moving, and now it's, you know, just now stops. And the sound acts weird every once in a while, but I was having fun on a world yesterday. Let me go back to that world real quick, and I'll show you. I was actually getting into it. I was like, man, I need to stop playing this game. So uh, let me go in here, because it's, it's too easy to sit here and go, okay, I want to live stream and have, you know, this in, have everything good and uh, nice and laid out and everything. See, I got... Ooh, what is that? I don't like that. Okay, let me get this, and I'm going to set... You can do that thing right there where it adjusts it up. Uh, you can change the sound up or down. Just like you're simulating sound on, on the device. And we got full screen again there. There it is. All right, so I would... Uh, I want this right here, so I just switched it by pressing the uh, 8 button. Or the number 8, rather. So it it, uh, it, all, it has all the uh, qualities of an, the Android version. Like I can still sprint. I have hunger bar here. I have you know hearts and all that stuff. And I have as you see down here enchanting, and all that stuff is is the same. So this is a great way for you to be able to enjoy like the beta version of the game before everything else comes out. And you can probably export your world and all that stuff too. That way you can. Uh, Keep it on your iOS device, and then once it actually comes over final release, you can be like, oh, cool, you know, I can actually do this. You know, I already have this world made and everything. So, that's the only thing. Uh, this right here does not work very well. Like, when I'm trying to, like, I don't think I would recommend, like, PvP on this. Because it's not 100% perfect. So the movement right there, like, the, like, I can run. I don't run. Oh, I can't run right now because I have food. But uh, normally I could run, but I can't run and jump. Well, I can't run and jump, but I can't uh, like move forward into the ride at the same time while I'm running. It's like either or. And see, there's that sound that I was talking about the bug. But this is, like I said, this is a really good uh, thing to have. If you don't have an Android device and you want to try the beta out before it comes out, and you can probably get the APK for free or whatever online. But uh, I want to show this to you guys because it's really cool. And if you don't have an Android device or maybe you don't have a mobile device, period, uh, this is a great way to be able to play games without having a mobile device. You know, mobile games and stuff like that. I could play. I could pull up like Angry Birds and play that and stuff like that. So. But anyways, guys, uh, this is free. Uh, link is in the description. And uh, let me know in the comments what you think about this. And make sure to smash that like button so I know you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, you guys. Y'all have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Skizzle!